Hi everybody and welcome back to the medium village of Revilia. Our cult is still just hanging out, looking longingly out in that direction. Look at these level 3 homes. Oh, this is looking really nice. Things are going well in the village of Revilia. All of our... God, I can't look at these people anymore. They freak me out. Ah, last time. Excuse me, sir. Oh, we have to pay our respects. We lost some dudes in the last episode because we had ourselves a wonderful, victorious battle. It was great. I think there's still quite a few dead bodies up here. Yeah. Yeah, we still have quite a few dudes that need to be buried. But the game is saved. So that's great. Good stuff. We have a whole bunch of people not doing anything. There is some building going on. We have that one level 3 that they're working on. We have our shrine that we're building in memory of the uh, the Battle of Linhart Farms. Nice. We're going to have that going. And yeah, I, I have some ideas. We have a problem with beer still. I want to upgrade more of these homes so that we can make it to the large town. We only need three, but we still have a problem with beer. We can't grow barley in this territory at all. And uh, I feel like we've done so much to help them out. We upgraded the brewery to have two families that are just waiting because there's nothing to do. We have our malt house fully staffed. We have a storehouse that has a person in it. Let's get... You know what? We're going hard. We're putting two more people in it. Please transport some stuff. This whole storehouse is dedicated just to malt, hop, or barley, and flax, and that's it. Please move these things around. I think there is... Yeah, there's like one thing of barley. Ugh. We need to get this moving. We have to have a steady beer supply. I can't have these people mad at me all the time. It's real bad. So... I was thinking, since we have food at a good place right now, I want to cut back on our food orders just a there little bit. Right? right? Just a little bit. I'm thinking we'll take them all back to 20. Just as like an emergency supply, right? So we'll try and maintain 20. Hopefully this will allow us to save up some more dough. Because what I'm thinking about doing, check this out, the barley, we could pay 120. We could afford it now, even. Which I did. I didn't even think about it. I just went for it. It seems like a good idea, right? Oh, I hope I did the right thing. Sometimes it's nice not to think about things and just click buttons, but it's not always the best, right? Ah, I hope that was a good idea. That's all of our money gone. But, we don't really need it for anything at the moment. It's a rainy day. We saved the money for a rainy day and we spent it. Nice. Awesome. Check this out. We've got our large granary. Oh, it looks pretty nice. I'm liking this. It's looking pretty fancy and it looks as though we can have more people work here. Oh, I like it. Oh, nice. Alright, cool. Let's assign some people to this straight away. Large granary? Should we do three and just leave two builders? We may as well, right? Please, move food around. I know we have some at the trading post. Not anymore. Okay, good. We had some at the trading post. But we also have things like this. Look at the communal oven. It's beyond full. Somehow they managed to squeeze one more bread in there. Good job, guys fantastic all right we built the final house as well so our two builders are probably going to be focusing on our shrine um we still have quite a few bodies sitting there and the pantry is full oh yeah i know about this so we have tons of bodies and it keeps saying that, okay that generic storage that makes sense before it kept on taking me to a house to someone's house it was somewhere down here and I kept looking at it, and it was fine. I don't know what the game was on about. It seems to be fine now, though. Okay, good. Alright, so, hopefully, with these orders in, 
We have a bigger granary. We have a storehouse dedicated to this. Please, can we get some beer in? We have, if we take a look at the trade, do we have any money? We don't even have any money right now. <laughs> Where is this dude? Dude, he doesn't even have anything. He's got nothing on him at the moment. That's sad. Where is he? Oh, okay. He's pretty far. He's got quite the trek. Okay. Fine. So he's gonna be a minute. But at least we have a dedicated beer merchant. And hopefully we'll actually have some money to pay him with when he gets here. Oh no. We got the dreaded royal tax increase of blackness. That sucks. Um... Are we going to be able to afford this? It's 307, 183 days left, and we're already at 229. Ugh, I was, I was even considering taking taxes away for a little bit just because, you know, we have so much prob lack of entertainment. Oh yeah, we don't have beer. Yeah, that is very entertaining, isn't it? If only we had a gallows, I can entertain you guys so much. Oh, how big is this getting now? It looks the same. Maybe that's the maximum amount of graves that'll actually uh, populate. I'm not sure. These guys should be, if we take a look. People, where are you guys at? Transporting, Margaret? You're not transporting. What, you're transporting the shovel? He's transporting a basket? I'm expecting bodies. Should, there we go. We've got some people moving some bodies. Ah, oh, that's disturbing. Oh, are they going out? It looks like they're taking them maybe to the, uh, to the corpse pit. Is that where you guys going? I guess it would be mainly the enemy's bodies. Because we did kind of surround them and kind of destroy them. Oh, look, it's another shrine. Ah, to the first battle we had. We don't talk about that one. We don't have to talk about that one. Nice, move pe more people are moving in. God, I'm so excited. I can't even speak. Jeez. <laughs> All right. So, we're still pretty much just waiting on the beer, you know? We have more people moving in. We don't really have any building going on. So, and good thing, we got some money, which is nice. Uh, I was gonna buy an oxen. I wanna fill out stable row, but can't do it right now. I wanna save that money and make sure that we get some beer in. It's mucho important. Look at all these full storages, though. We really need the oxen. Ah, <sighs> in due time. Things are coming together. It's just taking a little while. Oh, nice. Since we had so many builders and I had nothing for them to do, I assigned two families to a small stable on Stable Alley. And look, this generic fool symbol, there was like three of these. It's down to one. <laughs> nice. They're moving things about. That's good stuff. Since we, uh, we have six months of food now, I put the orders down. I put the orders way down for food. Down to 10. It's just a luxury now, right? It's a luxury to have 10 honey. That's fine. I also upped the barley back up to 30. I don't know where dude's at. He's just having a fun, fun old time all the way in this corner. Oh, he's not that far. Nice, and we actually have some money. That's good stuff. I noticed we did, yeah, we just got eggs and vegetables in. And we lost four honey. Again. Always losing the honey. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, dilemma. We could. Look at how many people you could put in an apiary. Right? Oh, man. We should probably take these people out of the stable and get them working on some bees, right? I'm gonna do that. Let's do that straight away. Forget moving stuff around. We're going to put an extra family in that one. And I put another one... Yeah, down here. We'll put another family in this apiary as well. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, cool. Forget about this symbol. It's fine. It's going to be there for, like, the rest of time. Oh, nice. Alright, cool. So, back to the waiting game for us to get some beer. Oh, boy. Alright, I got a plan. Look at this. Pantry is full at the communal oven. It's crazy. I really think not selling bread is gonna be 
just it for us. Because look at this. We still... There is still flour to be made into bread still. And it's like... Ugh. It's only... It's July. It's crazy. Alright, so, my plan. Sorry, I got distracted. What I want to do is try and grow some barley. Right? We have, like, no fertility for it. But what I'm thinking is... This little spot right here, I mean, it's yellow. I want to see if we can get, we'll change this field, and I want to see if I can add another little field here and here and on the back and make that all barley. And then to replace this field, because look, it was nice on this green pasture. It's, ugh, it's a shame we got to get rid of it. But look at this bit of green right up here. Let's see if we can get one whole Morgan <laughs> up in this area, right? Let's do it. We're going to try and get one whole Morgan field. And I want to go from like downtown, right? All the way from downtown out to here. How far? Okay, it'll let us go all the way out to there. Is Oh, that's 1.7 Morgan. It's too many Morgans. Okay, let's tone it back just a little bit then. Just a little bit. Actually, we'll start from here. Yeah, that should be good. And we'll go to the edge of that. And then right to our boundary. And we'll try and make it one Morgan. 1.2? 1.1? Ah! We'll do 1.1. Perfect. Nice. Alright. And we're just going to copy whatever this was. So what are you? Your fallow wheat fallow? No problem. That's no problem at all. Fallow wheat fallow it is. Alright. Nice. And that also means that this field... Oh boy. Let's try and switch this over. What is it right now? It's just fallow. Okay, good. So, let's check it over to barley next time, and then it'll be fallow. And we'll try and do the same thing around it, right? We'll try and get two more fields so that we could have a nice rotation. All right, let's try and do this. I hope this works. I'm so sick and tired. I'm worrying about beer. Alright, we need two more fields out of this mess. Alright. Let's try and get two more Morgans. Why aren't you following the road? Ah, come on. You know you want to. Oh, look at this. I got the one Morgan. It's perfect. I love the shape too. Nice. Alright, we got that in. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, what do we want this one to be? This one is Fallow Barley Fallow. Let's make this one fallow, fallow barley. Nice. And then this final one. The final barley field. Um, where do we start to make this work? Maybe back here? This is going to be a weird one. Is that... Oh, it's 0.8. It's so close. It's so close to one whole Morgan. What if we back it up to here? Oh, this is going to be really weird. Alright. Go out to here. Is... It's one Morgan. Or no, point 0.9. Oh, don't worry. We got this. Hold on. Ah, I wish we can go out a little bit further. Alright, hold on. Some of our one Morgan might be a little red. But that's fine. That's that point 0.1. That point 0.1 is that little red bit. Perfect. I'm calling that perfect. Alright, nice. Please grow barley. We're trying to throw a party. We have no beer. It's real sad. Good stuff. I hope this works. 37%, right? Alright, so we got barley, fallow, fallow. Fallow, barley, fallow. And then fallow, fallow, barley. Perfect. Nice. Please work. Look at this. This looks nice, though. I like it. Ah, uh, we finally got some beer in. It's about time. Quick, I'm pausing it real fast. Before anything happens, upgrade this to a level 3. Okay, good. We did it. What do we need? We need two more. 
can we do you? We can. Nice. There's our two. I kind of want this one as well. Can we? We're going for it. You know, it's good to have an extra. We only have one family doing the building. But, oh man. That's it. We should be a large town after this, which means we get a development point. Oh, we're going to have to think about that. I'm really going to have to have a think about that. I did, I put an extra family into the farmhouse because they're plowing this, uh, this field by hand real quick. It's July. I don't know if there's any real point to putting extra families to try and do this. I was thinking about taking away from, where am I, the berries? Oh yeah, we definitely should. That's pretty much out. Let's take two families away from there. Two away from here. That should be enough to finish that out. And just real fast, let's get them down here. There we go. We'll leave one builder to do those upgrades. I want to see if we can sew this real fast. I don't know. I mean, it seems pointless, but... You know, why not? It's July. Uh, eh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. At least it gives them something to do. They need the practice, right? They need to learn to how, to learn how to plow by hand. The joys of plowing by hand. Look at all of these happy people. I kind of wish they were actually doing it with their hands, but I guess a hoe's fine. I guess a hoe is okay. Alright, nice. It looks as though they were able to sow the entire field. And it grew by 1%. Awesome. I took all the people from our foragers huts and just left the skeleton crew to get the, uh, the herbs that we also produce here. And I think there are still like four left. Oh, there's three. There's three berries left to pick. Ah, oh, nice. I put them all in the farmhouse, but, you know, we finished that one field. These guys are just, they're still plowing by hand. What are you guys plowing by hand? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what they're plowing by hand. But we have a new family moving in, which is real nice. And we have to find something for all these people to do. Oh boy, I guess we could put some people to help plow by hand whatever you guys are what are you constructing oh they're like building things now too all right go get them she's got herself a mallet she's ready to get the business all right fantastic oh it looks like they were still messing around in this barley field for some reason i guess they, they did a little double check and they were like nope we didn't actually finish it that's some good quality control, guys. That's real nice. I think I forgot to hit record that whole time. I hopefully I wasn't talking for too long before I hit... Oh man, I'm an idiot. But look, da -da -da -da, we did it. We are now a large town. <laughs> Fantastic. It's still summertime, which is nice. Let's take a look. Ah, at our beautiful Revilia. Look at this. Our town center is looking mighty fine. I am loving this game. This is looking so good. We want to make sure, and I already did because I, I thought I was recording earlier, but I'm not. I am now. That's good. I upgraded some homes around here to level 2. I want to make sure we have all of these level 3 at the very heart. I want to start upgrading and making sure, like this one, I upgraded the level 2. We'll do this one as well. Bam, level 2, go for it. We're going to go around and just do all level 2 around this. Right? Get ready for the next level. But, for right now though, we need to decide what will be best for us. What upgrade can we get? I am thinking maybe the orchard. It takes three years. But, that could be a really, really good source of food. What else do we have? Foreign suppliers. Uh, trade stuff would be really nice. We do have quite the little trade empire going on. We don't need the deep mining just yet. Um, we could have... Oh man, there's options. We have options. Doubles the amount of meat. Uh, 
Ah, uh, we're going with the orchard. I already know it. We may as well. It's a good source of food. And we just, we really need it. We need the food. I've learned the importance of food. Where on earth do you build an orchard? All right, so it costs 50 to get these in. What we're going to do next time is build some real big plots like this that we build for our vegetables. We're going to build some really big ones for some orchards. Oh man, this is going to be so cool. I'm excited. Oh, I'm so excited for the next episode already. Jeez. All right. Well, that is where I'm going to have to go ahead and end this episode. I hope you guys all enjoyed watching. We got a lot done. Things are looking up. Things are looking real good. I think we'll be able to grow enough barley to satisfy our tavern needs. And then once we get that sorted, the sky's the limit. We got food sorted. And if we have beer and food sorted, holy hell. Oh, happy day. It's going to be great. So next time, we'll build some beautiful big orchards. Oh, it's going to be great. But that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did enjoy watching, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos where we leap tall buildings and go through some. It's great. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! I have no idea what's going on here.